I'm gonna try to make a dog to go with my little metal man here. So these are the pieces I have left of all my scrap. So I'll try to somehow make a dog out of that. I think I'm gonna use this as the body. the same length these two and this is one longer one here so I'm gonna put the leg I think I'm gonna do one here one here and then the two shorter ones up front here Kind of a mock up there. So I think I'm gonna put those two in the back for the legs and then weld those on first and then kind of place these. I don't know, maybe I should do these in the back, these in the front. I'll have to lower the back down though, so it'll be kind of squatting. Maybe I can do that, have him sitting sitting down. I think I'm gonna do that so it's kind of squatting more in the back. So I'll weld the, the shorter one on the back here. The taller one on the front. Then the dog will be a little squatting. I'm gonna start with that. legs welded on there. Now I'm going to do the front two here. Like so maybe. This piece spins so I'm going to try to Get something under it here to keep it from moving. There. Stick it on that. But I wanted it up a little more. fours at least.
got it on all fours here. It's got a little pause. Now I need to figure out a head for it. I feel like this is way too big. Might have to try to get a gear off here or something. These are pressed on. I don't know if I'll be able to get that thing off. I think it's all one big unit there. Don't have any too many other options. That's just way too big. Take, try to take this stuff off, this gear off, and these bearings off, and maybe take this housing and then see if it'll fit on there for a head. It still might be too big, but so I'm gonna take the rest of these bolts out, try to slide that off, and get these bearings off here. Got the gear off, that other bearing off, but I feel like this is still way too big for a dog head. I don't know. Maybe that would work. If I stuck it like so, be a really big dog head. some eyeballs on it. I don't know what I have. I have it's got one of these. Or I might do that. Might work like that. I'm gonna ask my daughter, see what she says. What do you think, Clay? Does that look too big? Does it look silly? What do you, you think it looks fine? Is this a dog with a big head? Okay. So dog ears? Well, that's the body. And that would be the head. Would that be fine? If I just do it like that? Okay. That's what I'm going to go with. I'm trying to get this piece out. I got big gear in there. Dog, big head. I'm gonna stick this on. This one's on here. 
backwards. I'm gonna stick it on backwards here, put the bolts back in. See what it looks like. If that helps with the dog face or not. Give it a little more character. Yeah, kind of like the man's face. I took it and put it on backwards, so I think I'll leave it like that. I'll put the rest of the bolts in the back. And it needs eyes and some ears. Try that. I had it down like that, but it just looks kind of too wonky. So if I put that there for a neck, and then weld that on there, that's what I'm going to do. Weld well, this in place first, and then put the head on. pretty but I don't care it's hard to weld on rusty gears and the head on its body there I think I'm gonna add this on here for a tail so I'm gonna do that next and I still still need to figure out the eyeballs and maybe some ears I don't have a lot left here though. So, to be, might have to find some other things in my shed laying around. Let's see what happens here. But I'm gonna go ahead and weld the tail on now. All right. Got a tail. Starting to look like a dog. Kinda. Dog with a really big head. I right, found some washers I'm gonna weld on for the eyeballs, I think. And then I need some ears. And I found a piece of metal. I think I'll cut some ears out, maybe some pointy ears. Weld those on. made a little tongue for him. I'm gonna stick that in there, weld that on now. It's got a tongue now. Coming along. Tail, tongue, eyes. 
cut out some ears. All right, I cut out some ears, this piece of metal here. Just weld it on there, one there and there, and then I'll grind the edges off so they're not so sharp. around the ear a little more. Wait, can I try? Yeah. So grab the, <laughs> grab the pliers. And then squeeze the handle down. Go ahead, pull it together. Yep, okay, now bend it toward me. Toward me. Ready? You feel it bend? Yeah, wait, I wanna try this. Oh, perfect. Yeah. How's that? Too crooked? I think that actually looks fun. I like that better. Yep. Okay. Yep. Can, I want to try to do it. Like you want to do the other one? Okay. Yep. Grab it and then pinch it down. Okay. And then push down. Ready? Really good? Yep. All right. I'm glad you thought of it. is one metal doll. It's got his tail, four legs, ears, really big head. Gave him a tongue. It's pretty neat. Some of the gears still even spin. Now my metal man has a little dog friend. It's all made out of uh, Volkswagen transmission gears. I had two spare, or three spare trannies, I think. Just took it apart, because they were garbage. 